Hey guys, Gaston from Connecting Tennis here. Welcome to another video. So excited for what we're gonna be covering today because it's actually a very, very fun uh, shot and it's a, I'm sure it's gonna be a very fun video to do. Remember, next Monday, January 20, I'm gonna be opening the registration for the forehand week. It's gonna be where on February 3, 4 and 5, I'm gonna be releasing three videos, okay? Video lessons covering for me the most important things to improve your forehand. I wanna help you with that. A lot of people have been asking for this for a long time. Not everything was, you know, was able to, to put in there because it's so many things that we could talk about forehand. But after the event, the forehand week, you're going to have news on what's coming next. So that being said, today we're going to talk about the banana shot. I mean, most of the players and coaches call it the banana shot on the forehand. That shot that when you run, okay, to the side, you hit mostly from outside of the court or probably in this case in singles case from the alley the double alley and the ball goes from outside and comes in again and it's a great resource to hit a pass into your opponent when you're in a tough situation so i'm gonna be showing you some details on the technique on how to get in the ball and then of course some shots of me executing it that i know you guys like it and i love to show and and to keep training myself to be able to execute everything as as best as possible to show you guys uh, so you guys understand better what I'm talking about. So when we talk about this, it doesn't matter if you're playing in clay court and hard court, because in clay court, I'm gonna show you here, imagine that I'm outside there. If you play in clay court, you'd arrive, you'd hit the ball, fall, and then probably you'd keep it sliding. And on hard court, you'd hit the ball, fall, and then just a quick recover. So, one of the things that you have to keep in mind, and we always talk on the forehand on hitting in front, hitting in front, hitting in front. In this shot particularly, you will need to let the ball come inside a little, behind the ball give me a ball please you will need to get from behind the ball and if we talk on the forehand that we hit here for the cross court we will wrap it around from outside for the down the line we'll hit more from behind the ball here you can see on this ball you will need to let it drop okay i mean most of the time this ball that you're going to be hitting when you hit the shot the ball is actually between your knees and the floor it's actually a very low ball and you will need to get from kind of like under and wrap it up very quick and here is when the, it's going to be tested the speed of your hand because you're going to have to wrap the ball up and if you see here with my hand imagine the racket you will come from kind of like the seven between the seven and the six and you're going to wrap it up around almost like covering the three and covering the ball and it's brushing very fast with your hand you're going to see pro players while i'm talking doing it and then you're going to see myself doing it So remember, the three keys here is the hand speed. You will need to develop hand speed. We have videos talking about that. I know you guys see it. Um, not hitting the ball in front, not hitting in front. You will need to let it come a little so you're able to just to brush your hand uh, a little more forward. Sorry, a little more up instead of, of forward of what you'd hit the forehand down the line. And very, very, very important that you are smart like I always say when you play it, okay? You don't need to put a 200 miles per hour forehand here. What you're looking actually is just to take the ball from outside to hit a passing so your opponent can make it. We see a lot of this in grass also, but where the opponents, you know, the players jump into the, into the grass because it's different. We don't see that much uh, on clay court and hard court, but it's a great shot. It's gonna be a very, very funny shot to, to record and I know for you guys to, to do it. And I have a lot of people asking about it also. So I'm gonna leave you now with me hitting balls, different speeds, different fits. I hope you guys really enjoy it. Comment below if you have any question, if you have any comment about this video, just let me know below. I always try to answer positive comments, you know that. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.